Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Meechu. In today's video, I have no idea what look I'm going to create. आपको पता पड़ गया होगा thumbnail देखके. But honestly, मैंने अब तक तो कुछ सोचा नहीं कि मैं क्या करूँगी. But I want to do something full glam but wearable glam. आजकल मैं बहुत सारे YouTube videos देख रही हूँ, makeup videos देख रही हूँ. तो मेरा भी मन कर रहा है कुछ old school step by step makeup video बनाने का. So I'll just go with the flow and let's see how it goes. And first, I'm going to use this mist from Pixi. It's called the Rose Glow Mist. ये जो मैंने पहली बार use किया था, तो मुझे समझ में नहीं आया था। मेरे साथ ऐसा बहुत बार होता है। तो मैंने वापस इसको दो-तीन बार use किया, और फिर मुझे actually बहुत अच्छा लगने लग गया, बहुत अच्छा glow देता है, बहुत hydrate करता है। So I'm going to use this. Shake, 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 shake. Rub up. Look at this. It gives you that instant glow, and it's like that I'm a good child who drinks a lot of water, and its skin glows because I'm eating fruits and water. But no, this is the reason. So this is a really good product, really great to hydrate your skin. So first I used this. Now I'm going to use a moisturizer, and I'm going to use this one. This is the Belief the True Cream Aqua Balm. Love, love, love the consistency of this cream. It's so hydrating. If you guys know me, you know how much I love glowy, hydrated skin. And this moisturizer is very good. It's fun to put it on. I take a lot of time in prepping my skin because I feel your makeup will look very good. If your skin is prepped well, if your base is smooth and smooth canvas, then your makeup will look very good. And your skin care is also good. And also, I really love to do skin care because it feels like a therapy. It feels like a massage. There are so many new makeup products in my collection. So, today I'm going to use a lot of new ones. But there are no changes. Like, I'm going to use the Laneige sunscreen. I tried the sugar sunscreen. वो भी बहुत अच्छा है, but इसकी बाद ही कुछ और है, so I'm going to use this one. You actually don't need to apply anything after this. You can skip your foundation and you can just go with concealer and your skin will look flawless. Just look at this. So now my skin is well prepped and ready for the makeup and today I'm going to use a foundation which is not usual because if you guys know me you know how much I love glowy dewy foundation but today I'm going for a matte foundation and this one is from Fenty Beauty in the shade 240 I know, I know, this is really unusual, but just like I always say, makeup is my mood. So today my mood, I don't know how matte it is. So today I'm using matte foundation. And this is actually soft matte, it's not matte matte. And now because it's a little cold, so I thought let's try it. And today I've never made a video on this YouTube video, so I thought let's do it today. I'm going to take a really tiny amount of it because it's a lot of its coverage so I'm just going to put it in the center here and a tiny bit of it To blend my foundation, I'm using the Roof of Beauty RB23 This is the step where you should take your time to blend your foundation because blending is the key Take your time, take it slow but do it really really nicely Although this foundation is matte but it's not drying at all it's really light weighted and plus the finish it gives is like really really soft matte and it looks so so good on your skin foundation is done and i'm actually really loving it actually the main reason why i don't prefer matte foundation is because i feel it's very cakey and it very dehydrated the skin i don't know i don't like it but this is something different that it's very soft matte and it feels like there's no filter on my skin one second foundation is i think pro filter 
I think this is my foundation favorite list. For my concealer, I'm going to use the Sugar Cosmetics concealer. This is in the shade 15 Cappuccino. I have recently started using this concealer and I'm quite loving it. The consistency is really nice. It's really easy to blend and that's the main reason why I love it because I really love to use concealer which tends to, you know, blend easily. So I'm really enjoying using this one. To blend my concealer, I'm using the Smashbox Concealer Brush and again blending is the key so take your time to blend your concealer, your foundation and if you see I'm just dabbing it and I'm not dragging it so that's really important. And yes I'm still using the K-Beauty HD Setting Powder, huh, I'm so sorry but I can't do without this product. Now next I'm going to use something really expensive. It's the Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood Contour Wand. And I have given this for myself two months ago. I thought that I would shoot so many videos if I had shot it. So I would gift a Charlotte Tilbury product gift. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> so I got this one. It's very expensive. The product is good, but it's not expensive. So I'm going to use this one and I'm not much into contouring. I do love to use bronzer, blushes, but the contour I have a little bit of a mistake. I feel like I'm scared of it, but let's use this. Now what I like to do is, I don't like to apply it over here. I like to apply it over here. I like to apply it a little higher, like here, so that my face will look lifted. So I'm just going to apply it a tiny bit. To blend this, I'm going to use the Nykaa contour brush. I think I have done a pretty good job. Next, moving on to the blush, I'm using the Milani blush. It's time for doing my eye makeup and first I'm going to brush my eyebrows using this spoolie brush from Rufa Beauty. For my eyes, I want to do something in uh, brown tones. So I'm going to use this palette. This is from Beauty Glazed Gorgeous Me Eyeshadow Palette. It's so, it's so beautiful. This is so gorgeous. I have used this in my Eid video. And when this came out, I have used this video. And I got it from an Instagram page called Beauty Bar Lounge. I will add the description in the description. And this section is very beautiful. It's a little brown. It's here too. So I am going to use, I think, this shade. With the blending brush, I am just going to apply it to my outer eyes like this. Taking a small blending brush, I'm going to apply the same color in my inner eye. And next I'm just going to take a clean blending brush and I'm just going to blend the outer part to make it look neat. Next I'm going to apply this cute little uh, Palladio Crushed Metallic Shadow and this is in the shade Meteor and this is a really beautiful shade. I'm taking a flat brush to apply this and now I'm just going to pack it on my eyelids. Now taking the same color, I'm going to apply it on my lower lashes. I have never applied any metallic eyeshadow on my lower lashes. So we will do this And the last step, I'm going to tightline my eyes using a black kajal and I'm using the MAC Black Coal Kajal. And now I'll quickly do my this eye and then we will move on to mascara. For my mascara, I'm going to use the Sephora Size Up Mascara and I got it from Dubai. But now it's available on website in India, so you can see it. For my lipstick, I have used the Miss Claire Matte Power Lip Color in the shade 06. So that's it 
for this look and that's it for today's video i really loved how the makeup turned out it looks really glam and it's so wearable so let me know if i should do a series like this like a wearable series just me aise create karungi kyunki mujhe bahut pasand hai aise looks so let me know comment section mein batao with yes or no zyada ke mujhe yes hi chahiye aur subscribe kar do agar subscribe nahi kiya hai to apne mummy ke phone se apne papa ke phone se apne bhai ke phone se apne bhai ke phone ke sab ke phone se subscribe kar do mujhe 300 ke kar do okay zyada demand ho gaya i'll see you next friday bye Thank you.